Hey everyone, Cody from Mac Telecom Networks. This is gonna be another on the job video. We're going to a manufacturing plant. I've already run the majority of the cables. We have one more cable to run, an access point to mount, and then we have to do a cable cleanup of the network room. If you'd like to hire me for network consulting, visit www.mactelecomnetworks.com and you can find us on Instagram. Now let's get to site. All right, now we're at the site and this is the network rack that we have to work with today um, and we need to clean up as you can tell. We're gonna be putting in a bunch of Ubiquiti stuff as well as a PF Sense. Um, we can see it's a pretty big rat's nest right now. Uh, they have this old CCTV camera system. I don't know what we're gonna do with that as the coax cable splits off and we have our power supply back there and the CCTV system is down below on the rack. Most of this is gonna be time-lapse. So hopefully you guys enjoy and I'll kind of explain what I'm doing when we start rocking some gear. So I've now taken down the cable managers as well as the Cisco switch which is sitting up top. This idea IP office is staying in, but what we need to do, we're gonna have to take off all these cables off the back of the patch panel. As you can tell, a lot of the jacks weren't properly punched down. So I'm gonna rip all of these off, but we're gonna label it first because the phones have to go back into a specific port into the IP office. Now the patch panel is taken out. I've labeled everything on the back of the cable. What we need to do next is sort these cables. So we're gonna do different bundles, one with voice and one with data. On the top of this rack, we're gonna have a USW Enterprise 24 switch and our NetGate 2100 as the firewall. And we're gonna have two different patch panels. So up top will be for our data cables and then below by the IP office will be our voice cables. So I now have the data run down and we have some Velcro going down into the rack. I put in the new patch panel and we're gonna start laying the cables into the patch panel and then terminating.
Okay, now our patch panel is in. I've terminated everything. We could see one blackjack will be using that for the CCTV. The purple jack will be for the server and the yellow jack will be for our internet uplink. There's a couple of cables hanging down here. That is for the server and the uplink, as well as the CCTV. So next we need to put in our enterprise switch. We now have the enterprise switch in and what I like about it is it goes all the way across with its ports. So I'm going to be plugging in six inch patch cables into each one of the data jacks and then we'll have to plug in our ISP connection as well as our server. and we're complete for the day we'll still have to come back there's some camera cables to finish up as well as some network but at the top we have our netgate 2100 and that's plugging into our isp which is a wisp um, on the top we have a 24 port patch panel using these six inch slim patch cables going into our usw 24 poe and below that we have another 24 port patch panel that's plugged into our via ip office using these red six inch patch cables And that's it for this video. I'm pretty happy with how it turned out. I still need to go back to site to clean up a few things, clean up the camera cables, and then label a couple face plates. If you have any questions about this video, please leave it in the comments below. If you like this video, hit the thumbs up button. If you're new here, please subscribe and hit the bell icon. All right, thanks.